I think our division um, could be argued as one of the toughest in, in the NFL. And so we're constantly beating each other up and, and playing some, you know, our competition that we're playing this year is obviously we have the number one schedule. I'm not sure what the other guys had, but it's not easy out there. Hi everybody, I'm Missy Matthews. Welcome to Steelers Live, presented by Microsoft Windows 11. Ben Roethlisberger talking today to the media about just how close the standings are in the AFC North before the Steelers will face their last two AFC North opponents. They have to play the Kansas City Chiefs in Kansas City at Arrowhead Stadium on Sunday. We do have some roster moves to let you know about today. The Steelers placed Marcus Allen, Zach Banner, and Devin Bush on the COVID-19 list. Now the Steelers did practice today and as coach Tomlin pr promised on Tuesday, it was going to be a light day of work. The past few Wednesdays, we've seen them in pads. Today, they were in the indoor practice facility at the UPMC Rooney Sports Complex. So let's take you through our practice report for Wednesday. Full participant Ben Roethlisberger, Isaiah Bugs, Kevin Rader, and Buddy Johnson, who missed the game on Sunday against the Titans. Not practicing today, one to keep an eye on. Pat Fryermuth, who of course is in the concussion protocol. Also Chris Wormley hurt against Tennessee groin. And then Joe Hayden, who was on a pitch count, he had the day off for a coach's decision. Now, of course, with Pat Fryermuth, the concussion protocol, excuse me, will be the guide if he is available to play on Sunday against Kansas City. We saw Zach Gentry step in for him whenever he went out against the Titans, and it was one catch, but it was a big one, especially uh, in the third quarter when the Steelers had the momentum in their favor. We know he's also a good blocker, and several times he's uh, really helped the Steelers' offense. Here's more on Gentry from Ben Roethlisberger. You know, the, obviously Zach's been here for a little bit and the guy that, that we trust and knows the offense and, um, you know, might not be the most explosive guy, but he's a guy you can trust. It's going to make the plays. And last week he made a really big play for us. So, um, you know, it's, it's if we don't have Pat, it won't be great. But uh, you have to have faith in, in Zach and, and, and obviously Raider if he's up to do, to do the, what we need them to do. An offensive lineman, Kevin Dotson, there you see number 69, returned to practice. He's still on IR, but his 21-day window starts today. So we will see when he is available to join the Steelers on the 53-man roster. Somebody quite new to the Steelers would be Taco Charlton. He joined them right after the season kind of started, and he has had a chance to be the next man up to put his hand in the pile, especially with injuries to TJ Watt and Alex Highsmith. And you could say Joe Schobert would not have picked up his first interception of the 2021 season if it was not the tipped ball by Taco Charlton. He also played for the Kansas City Chiefs in the 2020 season and knows a little bit about Patrick Mahomes. Definitely. I mean, they, they they did. I mean, lately they Pat has has learned a way to really kind of um, take what he's given and not kind of force things. So they haven't had begun as many turnovers lately as they did at the beginning of the year when he kind of wanted to get those points and go downfield. Um, he's staying more patient, so uh, you got to stay more patient with him. But there's still opportunities for always we get the ball out on ball carriers or whoever catches the ball, wherever it may be. So we'll still have our opportunities to, to get turnovers and, and change this game. Ben Roethlisberger today also asked about rookie center Kendrick Green working on the snaps and just building a relationship. Kendrick, of course, only had four games in college where he played the center position. And Ben says that he has to sometimes give him a little motivation to keep things going right. Here's more from Ben and Kendrick. It's been great. Um, you know, I think he took some heat um, in this building specifically after the Minnesota game for some of the snaps. And I walked in today, I said, hey, good job, no bad snaps. Everyone wants to get on you when there's bad snaps, but no one says good job when there's no bad snaps. So just wanted to reinforce to him that I think he's doing a great job. Definitely something, you know, I feel like, you know, it's good to good to hear, but also not looking for it either. Like Coach Thomas said, like, we ain't looking for no pass on the backs. You know, in the Minnesota game, you know, it's still no excuse for in, you know, I've had quite a few bad snaps this year. There's no excuse for it. You know, like Coach Thomas said, you got to have it fixed yesterday. <laughs> All right, thanks so much for joining me here today on Steelers Live presented by Microsoft Windows 11. Join us tomorrow for our matchup show as we preview Steelers at Chiefs. Have a great night, everybody. What's up, Steeler Nation? It's Terrell Edmonds. Welcome to the Pittsburgh Steelers official YouTube channel. Make sure you subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on everything going on in the Steel City. Thanks for being the best fans of football, and here we go.